Greetings. I'm Plug. Um, Bigo ID B R A D F Q R D. I'm also known as Trainer Plug. Um, I'm currently operating as the mayor of Bigo. And as the mayor of Bigo, I'd just like to welcome you to the app um, and also teach you a few things. Um, if you've made it to this training session, um, I'm assuming you've already completed your hosting audition uh, and you're ready to begin with your first app month uh, hosting on the app. So we're going to talk about what that means. Uh, we're going to talk about what are you trying to do? What are your goals? Uh, and we're also going to discuss a few methods of attaining those goals. Uh, and hopefully by the end of this training, you will be much more comfortable with uh, utilizing and operating within the app, okay? Um, so we all know live streaming from Instagram Live or uh, Facebook Live, even apps like Periscope, uh, where one takes their phone uh, and just records their surroundings uh, kind of haphazardly. Uh, explaining what's new and exciting in their life, right? Um, paid broadcasting um, is similar, except uh, instead of just hoping or or, or expecting uh, content or entertainment to uh, develop outside the world and you be there to record it, uh, in this situation, you yourself um, as the host, um, as the broadcaster, um, assume responsibility uh, for creating this content, right? You are saying that you yourself um, are able to create and generate enough interest um, in order to receive currency uh, in the forms of gifts um, and receive support um, from others based on uh, whatever you're able to present uh, to a live audience, okay? Um, so the basis premises is you turn your phone on, you go live, you produce some form of entertainment, whether it be communication, whether you're a great conversationalist, uh, you may play the banjo, um, you may have sex appeal. You know, you figure out what for you uh, is able to generate fans and, and support and admiration, and you find a way to uh, capitalize on your particular talents um, in order to complete your goals um, on the app, okay? So, the first thing we need you to realize is Bigo operates on PST timing. So, if you're ever scheduled for anything with Bigo, it will be uh, told to you in PST. Uh, the reason I want to start here is because the basis of understanding um, is knowing what day cycles and, and time zones you're going to be operating on because when we get to uh, telling you about possible events uh, and things of that nature that you can do, um, that may be something you want to know. Okay. So the basics. Um, this chart that I'm showing you here um, is known as a quota chart. Okay. This quota chart has different levels, uh, as you see on the far left side. Uh, these different levels have different payouts, as you see on the far right side. Now, the only way to attain these payouts is to complete the hours required and the bean goal for that particular level, okay? So as you see here, um, a $50,000 bean goal in conjunction with 32 completed hours of live streaming uh, will, will give you a cash out payment of $500. And twenty dollars. Okay, um, this goes up to a bean goal of four million, um, with a requirement of fifty-six hours streaming uh, for a thirty thousand dollar payout. So there is a broad range and spectrum uh, of live streaming, um, from entry level live streaming to uh, advanced, consistent, more uh, program based, uh, promoted or marketed items. Um, and, and there's a lot of different ways to, to attain uh, in, in those manners. So the goal here is to, for one, learn how to complete your hours, right? Because of the two things that we see here, um, as a broadcaster, you are only in control, in full control of one of those things. 
That one thing you are in full control of is those hours, okay? So how do you get hours? Well, as you broadcast, uh, time is kept uh, by the app, okay? You must stream for a minimum of 30 minutes for your live stream to be registered and for that time to count for that day. You can live stream for a maximum of two hours per live stream um, per day. That will count towards your quota. Any additional time in which you live stream uh, will not count as far as time. But any gifts that you gain while you are still live will indeed count. Actually, any gifts you receive while on the app will count towards your quota. Okay, so the goal is to do your hours, um, at least your two hours a day if you can, um, and maybe even more, um, because the longer you are available, uh, the more opportunity someone has to give you gifts. So make sure that you're able to find a comfort zone um, as far as location. Uh, make sure you're able to find some form of ambiance uh, that helps lure and draw in gifters, uh, but we'll talk about that soon, okay? Now, this quota does have two specific rules. The first rule is whichever agency you have joined, right? Members of your agency can only gift you 40% of your maximum beans gathered during that month, okay? 40% is the maximum number of beans that can come from people within your agency, okay? Um, the reason for this is they like for us to actually go out on the app and find gifters there uh, instead of staying within the comfort of uh, our own internal networks uh, and, and, and trying to um, outsmart the system, okay? So while agency members will be able to assist you, there is a limitation on the amount. The second concept is out of region beans, okay? So if you look at this uh, screen here, you will see a list of locations in which we as North American hosts um, and I'm hoping that most of you are North American hosts. It may be different. Uh, most of these rules do apply for North American hosts. You will see a list of places where we can receive our gifts from. Um, because our currency exchange rate is higher than some other countries, um, places that are not on that list, when we receive gifts from them, their gifts will count for the full value in our wallets, right? So when you receive a gift, 25% uh, of the gift's value goes to your wallet immediately. So receiving a gift from somewhere else will still equate to that. However, as in regards to your quota, only 20% of that gift uh, will manifest, right? So if I was to give you a thousand bean gift, um, which in America it ranges between 15 to $20, in your wallet, you will see about $2, a little bit less than $2. But in regards to your quota on uh, beans that count towards your quota, it will only increase by 200 beans. Okay. So the way we're mindful of this, um, I'm going to show you this screen here. Uh, and this is a message that Bego sends to hosts um, about once a week, um, sometimes even twice in order to give you a dashboard of your progress for that month, okay? So as you see here, um, not only does it have the out-of-region bean amount, um, but it also has your cross-agency percentage ratio, okay? So this is easy to keep up with. Um, the problem is sometimes people don't know, um, and the only place they've been taught to seek uh, information about their progress for the month is within the live data tab okay so the live data tab is still available to you but the live data tab does not differentiate 
um, between in region and out of region beans. Uh, it keeps up with the full amount of beans gathered by the host uh, and does not differentiate. So feel free to use that as a um, quick check, but make sure that you're checking behind the scenes as well. Okay. Now, when it comes to getting these gifts, um, I like to uh, note that there are two different types of gifts uh, that one can receive. Okay. Uh, one can receive an organic gift, uh, which is my favorite kind. Uh, it means that you've developed a relationship with a, a, a person, uh, a fan uh, even, or a person who enjoys your live streams. Um, and this person is willing to give you uh, gifts um, to support you. So we, we, we love our gifters um, because they are indeed what allow us to do what we do. Um, and uh, there is also a separate form of gifts to receive, which is known as doing business, meaning that you've decided to invest money in yourself, uh, maybe in the form of trades maybe in the form of, I'll give you a thousand beans, you give me a thousand beans, um, in the hopes to uh, reach a goal that you are close to, uh, but you do not believe you would reach organically, right? So uh, just be mindful of how you make your investments. Um, I'm sure uh, within your own agencies and your families, everyone has their own methods that work for them. Um, as far as my personal recommendations, uh, I just make sure that um, whatever you do invest in yourself, it is done with a purpose uh, and not haphazardly, okay? So make sure you do um, at least a little bit of research and, and, and get a few ideas about what's actually going to work for you, okay? Um, and while we're on this, this issue, uh, this idea of how to receive gifts, where gifts come from, how to complete our hours. Let's go ahead and talk about the completion of this process, okay? So we're gonna look at this quota chart one more time. Gotcha. And this quota chart, um, we're gonna pretend that we're at the end of the month and we have hit plan level A, right? So for 16 days, we did two hours worth of streaming. We have 32 hours. Um, We've also gathered 110,000 beans. And our payout um, for the payday of the following month, which ranges between the 4th and the 15th, um, the payout uh, amount for that is going to be $950. Okay? Now, once you receive this $950, um, I'm sure you're wondering, how do I convert this cash or convert these beans to cash. You'll simply click on your profile icon on the lower right corner on your Beagle app. Uh, you'll click on wallet, uh, you'll click on beans, and you'll click the exchange rewards feature. Um, this will give you a screen where you can put in the amount of cash you want to um, remove from the app, uh, and you will tell them which service you would like to withdraw it to. Um, we, um, or me, uh, those who, who work closely with me, I uh, recommend Payoneer. Um, I've had no problems with receiving my funds from Payoneer. Um, so we do ask that you create a Payoneer account. Um, the link is probably will be in the description. Uh, if not, I would definitely post the website link here. Okay, at least uh, the address. Okay, so make sure that you sign up for a Payoneer account. Uh, you're going to do a individual um, form and you're going to put in your personal information, okay? Uh, you don't have to give your pay and their information to anyone. This is for you uh, and it's going to operate as a uh, transfer account in order to convert your beans back to cash and it will indeed send it to whoever your financial institution is, okay? So when it comes to the basics, the extreme basics of the app um, in reference to getting your quota, how, what is a goal, and how do you actually complete uh, that cycle 
of getting your your money off the app or, or transferring your beans back to foreign funds, um, this is the process, okay? So thanks for checking that out.